short tour, short tour here uh, by uh, the Tikkun Elevator Kola here in uh, Parshas Tetzaveh. And we're going on to the what has been said by this tremendous Saba. The last thing that the Saba said was that you can't have good without balance. You can't have good without bad on the other side. Because if it's not there, there wouldn't be no concept of good. Now, this balance exists in the world which is called Zeranpen. And this balance is there not beyond Zeranpen, which is the world of uh, Bina, the world of of, uh, of, of Chachma, and Pnimi to that, beyond that, or inside of all of that. Let's go on. So when a person is on the wrong path and he abandons it. This causes the elevation of a Kodesh Baruch Hu in his glory. So here we see like understanding. That Shlemus is bringing good and bad together into oneness. In order to bring the bad into the complete good. So he's to bring all the bad into the realm of goodness. There is no nothing, there's only the let me read the English. There is no goodness except that which comes out of bad. We came out of Egypt. We managed to survive the desert. We're still living in deserts for three thirty four hundred years later, and we're still doing the same things. And this chafik he always you have to take the bad, take the bad, and make it into good. But that by a- amplifying, magnifying the kedusha al hachitzonim over the hachitzonim, evoking the shovel of the dagger that may be a kedusha, and then you break it out, you break through to draw from it the waters of kedusha. The high tov is talik yikari. This is the goodness that elevates the glory of the true one, the true one, Hakadosh Baruch Hu. The tov who misalev the kedusha of the Hakadosh Baruch Hu. And this is the complete war, the complete work. And this is how the Chitzonim are beaten down. A little bit more. We, until this moment, we dwelt there in the middle of this <clears throat> of this culture in which we live right now, all the days, all the whole year long, begin the Achvia b'mad b'ra the Hachu Sitra, and what we'll be doing out there, k'day la Hachnera Hachu Sitra after the Midbar, in order to go into that Midbar, and to be humbled down the Sitra Achna, Hashda the Malta Chazim the Bukhan the Chagadisha. But now you see that you have reached the time of the of the service of of, of Gedusha. The sitra, the gedusha, from the side of the gedusha, because here we are now. Shall avod this akodesh al side the gedusha that we're going to come to shavuos now. The kind of the kaim called mitzvah hazmanios shebechodesh tishrei. Now here he says we talk about tishrei. Let's substitute and say sivan. He says about had hadrana the yeshuvah of the taman ihu pochon to delay. Chazarna the Yeshav, we come back now because now it's that time. So he means to say that at the holiday time, we come in. Because only in the civilization is the place where the root of our Avodah can be learned. Because Yehudim, which means Yehudim, Yehudim means Zivugim, which is a basic Zohar idea in the desert, doesn't exist. Soon, furthermore, so now for a reason that you've returned to the Yeshiv. The Hashtag of Rosh Hashanah, Mata Zimna, the Haku, Kidja, the Mizbah, the Dinah, the Kamekh, and Kojibarechu. He said, Rosh Hashanah, 
So let's say this about Rosh Hashanah, so we'll just keep going that way. The time of the Nachash has come to claim Din before HaKadosh Baruch Hu. And that's the place where he has control. So it's in the Midbar, that's the place where he has control. So therefore we know that the, the time of Rosh Hashanah, he's saying over here, is a time of Din. It's like adding an extra force to the side of the Sitra Achra. The Taman ascended the Yeshuva, so therefore we leave the the desert is too dangerous at that time, and we come back and flock together. So therefore we left there, and we came to this civilized place. So don't get up and involved with them at that time. Now we're actually not in in Yom Kippur, so our excuse me Rosh Hashanah. These are not the days of the Din. On the other hand, the 49 days that we walk through the desert, those are the days of the same Klippos. Now we're coming through the desert, and we survived it. Up to this time, we're able to keep, can keep trying to learn Torah, bringing the Torah into ourselves and getting closer and closer to the Baruch This is Baruch Fleischmann. We're at the Tikkun Elevator Call-Out.